EA Sports. It's in the game. NCAA Football 2005. quarterback to figure out what holds this team together. His ability to read the defense and take what they give him is the reason they'll win this football game. He's a smart young man. I agree with you and I'm going to tell you why. Duke is going to have to play a flawless game on offense if they expect to win this ball game. I don't think they got a chance. Kirk, I don't see them moving the ball much against this superior defense. Kickoff, and we're ready to get this one underway. Short kick. He didn't get a hold of that one. Number six takes it at the 12. He's hit and got away. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 29. Number 25 lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. They go with the run. They'll bring him down. He takes the handoff and responds with a seven-yard gain. Second and three coming up. Ball on their own 36. They come out with three wide receivers. Taken down. What a huge run. Remember, this kid can fly. You saw in that run how he just took off and left everybody else looking like they got lead in their shoes. First and ten. Ball on the 46. North Carolina lines up in a shotgun set. Here's a draw. And they make the stop. So the draw to the halfback picks up four. Gain of four on the play. It's second down and six to go. Ball on the 42-yard line. Duke brings in their nickel package. He drops back. Throws this one out to the right. Brought down. Good yardage there. That'll move the sticks. Nice time to call pass here. It looked like the defense might have been looking rough. First and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Number four is back in the gun. It's a direct snap. And down he goes. 
The fullback picks up about three yards on that carry. It's second down and seven to go. And this is the sixth play of the drive. They find themselves in the red zone for the first time today. He's going right. And they get the first down on that completion, Coach. That was a very nice first down conversion. The key to that play was the fact that the quarterback had plenty of time to look downfield. On the 11, going in. Number 25 is a deep back as they line up in the eye. He gets another carry. And they make the stop. He carries the ball for three, maybe four yards. Back to pass. Throws it to the outside. And it's caught for the touchdown. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. the PAT. The fine folks at Pontiac bringing us this summary of how that drive took place. Ready to kick. Number 28, back deep to return. Short kickoff. Number 21 takes it at the 16. They'll get the ball here at the 28 yard line. Duke in a four wide set, drops back to pass. Over the middle, his receiver has it. Tackle, first down, what a pass. Boy, that was a big time throw by the quarterback. He did a good job of taking what the defense gives him. First and 10, ball on their own 41. The devil come out in the ace formation, looks, he's going left. And it falls incomplete. He needed a little more touch on his throw. He's got to take a deep breath, relax, and just play a little pitch and catch out there. Don't be anxious, kid. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. Number nine with three wide receivers. He drops back, steps up, looking across the middle. The ball is tipped. And an outstanding play defensively. Yeah, he timed it perfectly and managed to get a hand in there to deflect the ball away. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on their own 41. They're really struggling now as this crowd is going absolutely insane. Back to pass. Under heavy pressure. And he's going to come up with a sack. They got heavy pressure on him that time. Boy, you better believe it. The penetration got there and boom, he went down. Yeah, that pocket just collapsed right on top of the quarterback. Gets it off. Number two fields it at the 34. Well, the offense heading back out onto the field after that kick, hoping to turn this drive into another touchdown. They'll take over at the 38 yard line. First and 10. Let it fly! 
Drops back to pass. He's looking. Throws it to the outside. And they couldn't hook up on that one. A little too much juice on that one. And this quarterback sometimes gets a little bit too excited back there and tries to put too much on it. He's got to relax and just make a good throw. Second and 10. Ball on their own 38. North Carolina comes out in the shotgun. Here's an opening. Missed tackle. And he's tackled. And he picks up great yardage on the run. Yeah, and it looked like everybody else was in slow motion on that run. Boy, this kid is fast. It's first and 10. Ball right around midfield. The Blue Devil line up in a nickel back. He steps up. He's going to air it long. And that one's fallen incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. So it's second and 10. Ball right around midfield. North Carolina comes out with an eye formation. And straight ahead we go with a fullback. They'll bring him down. He plows ahead for a two-yard gain. It's third down and eight to go. Ball right around midfield. Duke puts six DBs on the field to counter this five-receiver look. And got it complete. And he's taken down. They convert on third and long, guys. With the offense coming through in a big way that time, how about the timing on that route, Coach? Yeah, Kirk, the quarterback was able to throw to a spot, and the receiver was there to catch it for a first and ten. Nice play. First and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. Number four lines up in the shotgun. He drops back. Over the middle. And he can't make the catch. He couldn't hang on to that one, guys. Well, I can't blame him for dropping that one. Did you see how hard that ball was thrown? Wow. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 27. North Carolina lines up with three receivers. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket, under pressure, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. A big time play by the defense. Well, he just really overpowered the offense there. He simply used power to slide right through and come up with the pressure to bring down the quarterback. So another third down upcoming for the offense. They line up with trips to the right. Drops back to pass. Swings it out to his man on the screen. And they got him for a loss. A one-yard loss. A long ways yet to go. But at the end of one, our score, North Carolina, seven, Duke, nothing. They come out in a punt formation. Number 45 boots it way up there. Number 23 signals for a fair catch. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll go to work at the 20. North Carolina brings in the nickel here. Here's a draw. And he's tackled. Pickup of less than a yard on the play. One yard gain on the play. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on their own 21. The devil come out showing three wide. And down he goes. Nothing gained on the play. No gain on the play. Third and nine, ball on the 21. Number nine lines up with five wideouts. 
The offense is doing everything they can just to call the plays, and right now, they're not having much luck at all. He drops back. He tosses it short. There he goes! And it's caught, and they push him out. On third and long, they get the first down, but was it close? Close or not, what a relief it is to the quarterback to have a new set of downs to work with. It's first and ten, ball on the 31-yard line. On the ground with a tailback. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Well, these guys fast or what? Good job of penetrating and getting to the ball carrier here. So it's second and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. The devil come out in a shotgun. Throws this one out to the left. It's deflected. Almost intercepted. Almost a turnover. As a quarterback, I can tell you that those are the only types of drops we like to see. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. Number nine with four wide receivers. Back to pass. Steps up. Going deep on the left side. Incomplete. A little too much juice on that one. This quarterback sometimes gets a little bit too excited back there and tries to put too much on it. He's got to relax and just make a good throw. And they're ready to punt this one away. He gets it away. Number two, fields it at the 40. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll start this drive at the 46 yard line. Drops back to pass. He's in trouble. Over the middle. And they make the stop. What a catch. And that's going to give him a first down. Well, that's a big play for the offense. But I think the defense needs to play a little bit tighter in the secondary. <laughs> it's first and 10. Ball on the 36. The Devil bring in the nickel package. He's going left. He might have a chance. How about that reception, Lee? A good throw plus a nice catch and some good blocking equals to a chunk of yards. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. First and 10, ball on the 17. In the red zone again. Let's see if it'll be another touchdown. They'll throw on first down. Wants to throw outside. And he's shoved out of bounds. They'll get six yards. On the 11, going in. from the shotgun. Defense looking for his first incompletion this drive. And he came down with it. What a catch. And he makes his second visit to the end zone with that catch. Well, that was a great catch by the receiver. He ran a perfect route to get open for his second score of the game. And he tacks on the extra point. Time to take a look at the drive summary. It's brought to you by Pontiac. Fuel for the soul.
North Carolina to kick this one off. Number 21 and number 28 deep to return. Here's the kick. Number 21 fields it at the 11. At the 40, down the sideline. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. It's first and 10, ball on the 46. The sellout crowd is really making a difference now as these guys can't even call the play. And down he goes. Number nine on the run. Nine yard gain on the play. Second and one coming up here. Ball on the 45. The Tar Heel line up in a nickel back. He drops back. Wants to get it out on the screen. Complete. Spins up field. And they hit him in the backfield. Six yard setback. It's third down and seven to go. Ball right around midfield. North Carolina lines up with five defensive backs. He's going right. It falls incomplete. He needed a little more touch on his throw. He's got to take a deep breath, relax, and just play a little pitch and catch out there. Don't be anxious, kid. They send out the punting unit. He punts it away. It's a high kick. Number two calls for the fair catch. And they make the fair catch at the 32-yard line. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll get the ball here at the 32. Duke brings in their nickel package. Back to pass. He tosses it short, and it's caught. Spin move, and he's taken down. Good yardage there, and that'll move the sticks. Nice time to call pass here. It looked like the defense might have been looking run. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. They'll work from the shotgun. He steps up, looks, pocket holds. He's rolling left, throws, and got him! Touchdown, North Carolina! And they had a tough time defending that one. Well, Brad, one of the things with this defense is you leave yourself vulnerable one-on-one -on -one coverage. Great throw by the quarterback and great speed by the receiver. Here's the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. for the kick. Short kick. He didn't get a hold of that one. Number 21 takes it at the 12. Can't wrap him up. The offense gets ready to start a new drive as they just couldn't get anything going on their last possession. Going three and out. They'll take over at the 24. 
North Carolina brings in the nickel here. Drops back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He's going long. In and out of his hand. The wide receiver couldn't quite hang on to that. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. North Carolina comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Throws it to the outside. A little too much juice on that one. This quarterback sometimes gets a little bit too excited back there and tries to put too much on it. He's got to relax and just make a good throw. Duke lines up in a goal line set. They'll try to power it with a fullback. Tackle. North Carolina takes a timeout. Duke ready to pump this one away. Didn't get all of that one. Number two signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the 42-yard line. Well, the offense heading back out onto the field after that kick, hoping to turn this drive into another touchdown. They'll go to work at the 42. On the 42-yard line. The Tar Heels line up with four wideouts. He drops back. He's going left. That looked like a pretty good pass. Yeah, it was, and it was a catchable ball thrown right at him. He just didn't catch it. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 42. Duke puts six DBs on the field to counter this five-receiver look. His receiver has it. North Carolina calls a timeout. Third and two, ball right around midfield. They're crowding the line. They'll run for the first and third and short. They'll bring him down. They tried to run the ball for the first down and they didn't get it. No sir, you saw the defense just power through their blocks and wham into him. Number 45 boots it way up there. Number 23 fields it at the 13. So the offense takes over, and the last time they had the ball, they had a tough time getting anything going. They'll start this drive at the 13. Duke will line up in a jumbo set here. Got an opening, and they make the stop. Some second half adjustments definitely needed in this one. Our score, North Carolina, 21, Duke, nothing. North Carolina got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. And it's a short kickoff. Number 21 fields it at the 13. And now we'll see the offense coming out out of the field for their next possession. They'll get the ball here at the 24. Number nine is back in the gun. On the ground with the tailback. He tries to spin, and he's tackled. And the delayed handoff works for a big game. Got to be happy with the effort there by your tailback. You are absolutely right. It's first and 10, ball on the 37. Duke 
Goes with the ace set here. They keep it on the ground on the tail. <laughs> Tackle. They almost gave them a present right there. Yep, the running back gift wrap did and everything. Lucky someone on his own team fell on it. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on their own 39. The Tar Heel bring in the nickel package. They hit it off again. And down he goes. Couldn't get anything out of that. No game on the play. Third and eight. Ball on the 39. They come out in a five wide set. Back to pass. Throws it to the outside. Someone got a hand on it. Fantastic play by the quarterback. All you young defensive backs at home, that is how you play defense. No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number 18 gets it off. Number two takes it to 28. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll take over at the 41-yard line. High formation here. And that defense is getting a little excited down there. Offsides on the defense. Five yard penalty. Still first that penalty will hurt. You know, this is all about discipline. The team that doesn't commit penalties is the one with great discipline. And that can be a huge factor in winning football games. First down and five to go. Ball on the 46 yard line. On the ground with the tailback. And he's tackled. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. Second and two coming up here. Ball on their own 49. The Devils line up in a nickel back. Drops back to pass. Throws. It's tipped. And he threw that one up for grabs. This is one of the things that drives a coach crazy. You don't want to do anything stupid. Make mental mistakes that may cost you the ball game. It's third down and two to go. Ball on the 49-yard line. The Tar Heel line up in a goal line formation. Third and short, and they hand it off. And he's taken down. And the tailback picks up the first down. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. Duke has all their DBs in for this five-wide set. Throws it to the outside, and they couldn't hook up on that one. Not much a receiver could do that time. You're right. Nice defensive play, and the key here is the defender's able to avoid pass interference. So it's second and ten. Ball in the 49. North Carolina comes out with an eye formation. Inside give. And they make the stop. He plows ahead for a two-yard gain. Gain of two on the play. Third the defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. The Devils line up with six defensive backs. He drops back. Steps up, looking. He passes it. It's deflected. We knew this drive was in trouble if they couldn't get the pass game going. And I think it's safe to say it didn't get going at all. No one caught a pass on that drive, and that, my friends, deserves a major league yoke. So they're set to punt this one away. Number 17. Number 45 boots it way up there. Number 23 calls for the fair catch. And they make the fair catch at the 15. 
Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll go to work at the 15-yard line. And straight ahead we go with a fullback. Brought down. And the fullback comes up with a nice run. This is just strength on strength right here. They give it to the fullback, and he powers his way for some good yardage and another first down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 26-yard line. The Tar Heel bring in the nickel package. And he stopped behind the line. And he couldn't go anywhere on that one. Now nah, he couldn't go anywhere because there was no place for him to run. The defensive front got a good push and knocked that offensive line backwards. Right, second down, and they got 15 for the first down. Ball on their own 21. The Tar Heel line up with six defensive backs. Someone got a hand on it. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads-up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. It's third down and 15 to go. Ball on the 21-yard line. The Devil with four receivers. Once it all, going deep. Incomplete pass. Overthrew his intended target. We talked about this before, how pressure causes the quarterback to hurry his passes. Here he felt the blitz coming and got rid of the ball a little too quickly. Number two, accurate return it. Punts the ball away. Number two, fields it at the 50. Inside the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, North Carolina. That's what his ability can do. Well, here you see a combination of things. His athletic ability, his ability to amplifies, and his speed accelerating by the defense. Keep this in mind, guys. He is capable of doing this every time he touches the ball. And he tacks on the extra point. Just over a minute to go here in the third quarter. And the score, North Carolina, 28, Duke, nothing. Carolina ready to kick this one off he kicks it number 28 fields it at the 11 so the offense takes over and they'll try to figure out this defense they forced them to punt the last time they had the ball it's first and ten ball on the 26 yard line And this offense is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. Here's a hand on the left side. They'll drop him for a loss. And the blitz might have caused that one. Well, the defense took a chance here. They overloaded that side of the ball, and the tailback had nowhere to go. Second and 11. Ball on the 25. North Carolina puts six DBs on the field to counter this five-receiver look. Pressure coming. Look out. And it's incomplete. Third 11 coming up here. Ball on their own 25. They line up with trips to the right. Back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. He's going right. Got his man. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. 
They convert on third and long, guys. With the offense coming through in a big way that time, how about the timing on that route, coach? Yeah, Kirk, the quarterback was able to throw to a spot, and the receiver was there to catch it for a first and 10. First nice and 10. play. Ball first and 10, ball on the 37. Number nine with three wide receivers. They go with the option. Big opening. And he's taken down. Unless we see some sort of miracle, this one's pretty much over. Heading to the fourth. Our score, North Carolina, 28. Duke, nothing. Second down and short, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. The Tar Heel bring in their dive package. Drops back to pass. Let's it fly. Complete. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. A one-yard loss. One-yard loss on the play. The offense faces another third down as they line it up. The Devils come to the line with their jumbo package. Here's a counterplay, and they make the stop. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. No game on the play. Fourth and one. And they're going to go for it. Controlling the line of scrimmage is crucial here. They'll bring him down. They get what they need, and that is a huge fourth down conversion. Brad, this is just a really great job by the O-line. They got a good push on that play. Nice job. It's first and ten. Ball right around midfield. Duke goes with the ace set here. They'll throw on first down. Look. Throws it to the outside. He needed a little more touch on his throw. He's got to take a deep breath, relax, and just play a little pitch and catch out there. Don't be anxious, kid. Second and ten, and this is the ninth play of the current drive. The Devil come out in a bunch formation. They are going to pitch it, and they hit him in the backfield, and they stop the halfback for a loss. And let me tell you something: that toss play had no chance whatsoever. Defense was all over it. Third down and twelve to go. Ball right around midfield. Single set backfield. He drops back. He's under pressure. Wants to go long and does. To the 10. Touchdown, Duke. They made that touchdown look really, really easy, Coach. And that's what you get when you practice hard all week long. Practice makes perfect, my friend. And that was as close to perfect as you will get. And he hits the PAT. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. And it looks like they're going to try an onside kick here with the onside kick. Well, that'll end all hopes 
of a miracle. You can say that again. This one is pretty much done. They'll set up shot at the 41. 41 yard line. Here's the give, and he stopped behind the line. Great job by the defensive lineman here to get a paw on him and put him to the turf. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on the 38. Number 20 lines up in the deep back, eye formation. And they got him for a loss. Boy, he is one big guy down there on that defensive line. Oh, man, the big fella's a hoss. I saw him last night at the hotel, and he had three bags of food going up to his room. Yo, it looks like he's got a big old bag hanging over his belt right now. It's third down and 13 to go. Ball on the 38-yard line. Duke lines up in a dime defense here. Taken down. Duke takes a timeout. And the punt team will come out. It's fourth down. He punts it. Number 82 takes it to 25. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll start this drive at the 38-yard line. They're really struggling now as this crowd is going absolutely insane. Drops back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Throws it deep downfield. Intercepted. And it'll be the safety that gets credit with that last interception. Let me tell you the reason why. He watched the play develop and made a break on the ball. And then he made a great catch. Those are all the ingredients that you need to intercept the football. Get the ball here at the 22-yard line. The Tar Heel come to the line with their jumbo package. And they make the stop. Short little game there, just trying to keep that clock running. Keep that clock running and keep that other offense off the field. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on their own 24. The Tar Heel line up in a goal line formation. On the ground, up the middle. He's hit and got away. And he's tackled. And not too much there on that run. Not too much, but the key here is try to milk as much time as possible. And it looks like we have our Old Spice players of the game. On the ground with the tailback. Got some open field. And down he goes. What a run on third down. You know, we're always talking about the importance of converting on third down. If you're going to have any kind of success, you got to be able to keep these drives alive, like they did right there. First and 10. Ball on the 41. North Carolina will line up in a jumbo set here. And they'll run him again. Juku, he spins. Brought down.
So this rivalry will have to wait another year to renew their acquaintances. Was this one any different than previous years? They've talked about the rivalry all week long, and for good reason. We saw the intensity down on the field every play, and it showed us why these teams love to hate each other. It'll be interesting to see how this game carries over the next time they play. Folks, that's going to do it for this edition of NCAA Football 2005. We hope you join us again soon. Again, our final score, North Carolina 28, Duke 7.